everyone, I hope that you're having a great day. Today's video is a little bit different than I normally do. I'm going to have three different speed paints playing and while I show you guys those speed paints, I'm going to be reviewing these glasses that were sent to me by a company called Fermu. I think that's how you pronounce it. I don't normally do videos like this, but this company's message really spoke to me. Their brand is all about making really affordable eyeglasses, like really affordable, like, like $30 for a pair of glasses affordable. When I was younger, my family went through a lot of financial difficulties and I guess I could make a whole nother video about that if you guys wanted to hear about that. And I remember I wore the same prescription of glasses for like three or four years and when you're growing up your eye prescription tends to change and so mine became a lot worse and it was very difficult for me to see. So the message of wanting to bring affordable eyeglasses to people really spoke to me. Um, so I'll be showing you guys three speed paints. They're all just really fun acrylic paintings and I did them while I was on vacation so I apologize for my chipped nail polish. Um, so let's just start the video. So before I say anything, I want to say that I really am impressed with the quality of these glasses. Given the price, I was expecting them to be like backup pairs or like um, fun fashionable pairs to have as a backup or maybe to have as a backup for a more expensive pair of glasses or a new style that you're trying out. I found that this wasn't the case. Um, my frames are metal with like plastic edgings. I don't know the correct terminology. And they're very sturdy. I had a more expensive pair of glasses and my little sister actually broke them. Shout out to Amelia. But I can't see that happening with these, um, especially because they're metal. As for the lenses, I found that they're very good quality. I had to do the thing where you measure the distance between your pupils. The one complaint that I have about these glasses are, um, I actually have two different prescriptions in my eyes and I think they might have put my Wiku prescription in both sides because I have a very difficult time seeing out of my right eye, which is my weaker eye, and it's a little bit more blurry with these glasses than I'm used to. So if you have two different prescriptions, I'd be a little bit careful. It isn't really a big deal because I can still see perfectly fine because as for the style, I really like them and I was really impressed with the selection that was on the website. The only reason I would be careful ordering them would be if you have a very different prescription in both eyes. I found the really the only thing that gets them clean is the cleaning cloth they provided. And it's this teeny tiny little cloth so it's easy to take with you so it's not really that big of a deal. The anti-scratch coatings are worth it in the long run because you won't you won't have scratched up glasses. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty much everything I have to say. I'm very impressed with these glasses. Um, the only reason I would be careful ordering them would be if you have a very different prescription in both eyes. I will have a discount code linked in the description for these glasses. Um, and thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you feel like it, you can subscribe. I'm really excited for my next video. It's going to be DIYs from a very recent and very popular TV show that I'm like borderline obsessed with. So stay tuned for that. Um, quick update on my house. I'm still in a hotel, um, have been for the past four months, but um, we might move in next week. So I really hope that happens. I'm going to college next week as well. So videos might be a little bit more sparse, but if you have any like requests for college videos I should do, or just any DIYs or videos in general, just let me know in the comments. I love you guys so much and thank you for being in my life. Bye.